Hello everyone, Petko Alexander here. Hope you are having a great day and in today's video I'll make a complete review for the Royal Indigo Orange Deck Green cards of Crypto.com. And I will do that because some time ago I have decided to update my Ruby Steel into Royal Indigo or Jade Green. Basically, we have the choice which one we want to get. And I have recorded a video about it explaining why it is better to upgrade your card when the Croc coin is on a cheaper level. Or if you are grabbing a card for a first time, it is always better to catch the moment when the Croc coin is cheaper. So if you have missed that video, I'll drop a link down in the description. And in this video, I will do the unboxing. I will activate it on my phone. I will explain about all the card benefits that you get when you are using a crypto.com card. So if you're ready, let's go for it. Recently, the crypto websites were flooded with the news that Crypto.com becomes the official sponsor of 2022 FIFA World Cup in Qatar, which is just amazing. Uh, recently, the company spends so much money on sponsorships like the deal to rename the Los Angeles Sports Center called Staples Center to Crypto.com Arena. And that deal is for 20 years. It's not one day marketing or something. As well, they partnered with the Australia Football League in a $25 million deal, a $100 million sponsorship agreement with Formula One. And one of the biggest is the deal with UFC where they have spent over 175 million dollars so these guys know how to do the marketing they know how to partner with huge companies and having a crypto.com card is a great idea because locking some money like staking Crocoin to get a card is not really a waste of money because this is an investment and it is into a company that spends millions for partnerships which somehow guarantees that they will be on the market for a while. Now let me go straight to the point. I will unbox that envelope and here we have the very same package as uh, the one I have shown. And what I will have inside, I guess it will be the very same thing. The letter from Cress, very personal letter, joking of course. And that's a Visa card. Behind I have the number, the expiration day, the CSV code, which obviously I won't show you. And before activating it, let me explain what are the differences with the Ruby card and what are the card benefits. So getting a Royal Indigo costs 3,500 euro in Cro coin stake. So you're not spending those money, you're not wasting this money, you're just investing them into Cro coin. You have to stake them for 180 days. And at the end of the period, you can decide to exchange them or to sell them. Of course, you will lose the card benefits if you do that, if you keep them staking, you will be able to get all card benefits, which are 3% Croc card rewards and 10% APY. So 3% cashback means that whenever I make purchases virtually or physically in a shop, in the mall, wherever there is a terminal, I'll be getting 3% cashback from the amount I'm spending. If I'm spending $1,000, it means I'll get $30 back in Croc coins. All right, this is the native token of crypto.com and that is the token that we need to stake for the period we are using the Crocoin cards. Now, the main difference between the Ruby Steel and the Royal Indigo is that with the Royal Indigo, I will be getting as well 10% APY and I will show you straight away how that works on my app. All right, so if I click on card, you will see what is my available balance. And then if I click on the small card icon in the top, you will see that here is my Royal Indigo that is not yet activated. I will do that in a second. But what I wanna show you is if I go to accounts and I go to crypto wallet, I will have the Crow coins right in here. I will tap on that. And if I scroll below, you will see that recently I've been receiving those 18.45 Pro coins every seven days and this is the reward or these are these 10% 
that you get as APY rewards or simply take it as a deposit and they are paying you back some interest because you're keeping those crow coins in your account or you're staking those crow coins. It's a passive income. So now let me go back and I will hit on that card icon again and I will hit on the small card in the right hand upper corner and then I will go to activate my physical card. I will need to enter the new CVV number. Here we go. And then it is activated, okay? It is that simple. I can use that card right now and I can make purchases. So the activation is super, super simple. The other benefits that we have are Spotify and Netflix. So the amount that you spend for Spotify, which is about $14, you will receive back as crow coin. Same thing with the Netflix, you will spend those $14, but you will receive them back as crow coins. Now, if you look at the other card benefits, you will see that with the Royal Indigo, I will have Airport Lounge access. And I'm not really sure how relevant that is to nowadays conditions when people are not traveling as they used to. Personally, I'm not traveling as I used to. Maybe this is because of the three kids at home. However, you will see that the other two cards, the Icy White and the Obsidian have way more benefits like Crypto.com Private, Earn Bonus Reward, Exclusive Merchandise Welcome Pack, Private Jet Partnership, and many more. However, at the time of recording this video, the biggest benefit and why I personally personally decided to update from Ruby to Royal Indigo is the 10% APY and 3% cashback. With the Ruby is 2%, so it's 1% more. And something I have forgotten to mention in my previous videos is that to deliver that physical card, I was charged 50 euro, I believe. So if you don't want to have it physically, but you want to upgrade your card, you can still do that. You need to write to cryptos.com support and uh, you tell them that you are not willing to get the physical Royal Indigo or any of the cards, but you wish to continue this physical card, you'll still get the 10% APY, you will still get the 3% cashback using the old Ruby card, but having the benefits of the Royal Indigo. All right, but for me, I just like to have them bought, even I'm not going to use that one anymore. Hopefully if one day I upgrade to the Obsidian, I will have them all and it will be some kind of a collectible value for me, if you will. All right guys, so this is pretty much what you're getting with the Royal Indigo or the Jeder Green. You have the choice which one of the two to order. With the Royal Indigo, it took about two weeks for the car to arrive. Let me know down in the comments how long time it took for you to get the card or any of the cards. It will be just nice to have some kind of statistics for everyone watching the video to know how long time they'll be waiting for it. I'm in Bulgaria, Europe. I guess this makes it a little bit difficult for delivery as they are shipping it from Asia, I believe. However, if you have such a card, it's a great way to get some passive income because every time we spend money, we are getting some cash back and we are spending those money anyway. So why not getting some cash back? And if you're investing in crypto, I think staking will be the future deposit method that the younger generation will use simply because they offer 10%. Which bank can offer 10% nowadays? Thanks for watching guys. I really hope that you have enjoyed the video. If you did smash the like button, I will see you in another video. Make sure to grab some free crypto from the links down in the description. And as well, I have reviewed the Binance Visa card. So see what are the differences in this video right now. And I wish you a great day. Don't forget that I will see you on Monday, Wednesday and Friday. Have a nice rest of your day or at least make it that way. Cheers.